boas notinhas aqui que eu vocês ter roubando capa e sejam muito bem-vindos a mais um Assassin's Creed Origin. Bem, é Origin, é uh, Valhalla. Bem, no último episódio que tivemos aqui neste um, fazer a parte dos filhos de Ragnar of Rock, vamos lá a mais um episódio. Estás tudo bem, estás bem, bro. Vamos lá começar, Maltinho. Ainda não começamos a acabar desta parte, por isso. Para ver se a gente consegue acabar desta parte. Queria muito era evoluir a parte das ações, só que não tenho muita ideia de ganhar o que fazer. Where is my son? We sent word to Repton, but we've had no word, Lord. I suggest we carry on. You sought me out, old friend. And here I am, standing before the throne from which I reigned not long ago. <laughs> you stand before us to accept this Witten's unanimous decision that you are unfit to rule and are hereby deposed. We demand the abdication of your kingdom and your crown to Thane Chairwolf. Mercia has spoken, Lord. The crown. <laughs> Is that you, old friend? Ah, yes, I see it now. <laughs> Forgive me. The robes of righteousness sit so loosely upon your shoulders. <laughs> if the heavens mismark me as king, forgive its obscuring light. Amen. Now, where is my crown? <laughs> Forgive my nerves. Here I am, an upright man who never once learned how to bend the knee. And yet, I shall try. Ah! <laughs> How simple it is. How easy to kneel without fear and feeling. He's mocking you, man. I'd kill the fucker. Worry not, Dane. I shall resign this crown and this pagan infested kingdom and the favors of these two faced men. But I will do so on my terms. My demands are simple. Firstly, you must... Bumba. You fool. Look around you. You have no leverage here. Plead for your life. For it is the only thing these men will grant you. Yes. Yes. Forgive me. I... I do not harm me. I beg of you. Please, I'll go anywhere. Here, I, 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 I resign it. Here, take this lord and his wife to Rome. He is hereby exiled, never to return. The Witten recognizes King Chairwolf of Mercia, second of his name, a just king. A merciful king! God save the king! Okay. It better be worth all this trouble. 
Mercy and soldiers marching on Repton. Leofrid. Loyal to the ugly ant bastard. Gather what men you have and split them between the north and south gates. That should divide his forces. Chilbert is there. Evo, you must save my son. Okay. You will come through this, I promise. I will stay here with Chil. Go. Passa aí na frente. Outside your Leo, fleeing across the river. I was chasing someone. It has to be Jailbelt. He is the only prize worth taking from this mudsink. Acho que é. Acho que acho que o comando era mais fácil. Eu também tenho um site um bocado para fraco, eu tenho que culpá-lo. Chase, so it has to be jailbent. He is the only. 
only prize worth taking in this mudsink. to do this. Leofred, let him walk. You answer to me. I answer to my king. Our silence deeds with this. Lay it by, Leofred. There's nothing left to fight for. We have stormed Repton. Only a matter of time. Mm. I cannot do that. Then oh. you will die. Someone will. You can't win this, Leofrid. Even if you defeat me, the Rachnesons have won the day. I have fought many a day in my time, but I'm still standing. Turn that! Burkrid was lucky. To stand in the way of you and Mercia is my duty. I will die before I yield. Ah, 
Mas ela vai lá pra mim. You can't win this, Leofrid. Even if you defeat me, the Rachmussons have won the day. I have fought many a day in my time. I am still standing. Oh. How does it feel? Strong will pain. Burkrid was lucky. To stand in the way of you and mercy is my duty. I will die before I yield. I will make you feel pain. What? Finished. Not yet. Fight me, heathen. You can't Tumba. Muito forte, meus. How does it feel? Tá. Toma. Eu não tenho flechas. Não merece. Calma. Jesus. Finalmente. Go on then. End it. No appeal to your god or your king. I swore an oath to serve Borgra to the death. I fought. I lost. We both know how this goes. An honorable Thane fighting a dishonorable war. Burkrid abandoned him, betrayed his trust. If I were Leofrid, I would want to know. Why rob him of this last glory? A warrior ready to meet his god and bask in his praise. To live will only lead him to shame. It's not an oath he would keep if he knew the truth. Mm. Then choose. Truth or glory. Stand, Leovrid. Live to fight another day. What? Your loyalty to Burkrid is not a loyalty returned. He resigned the crown and fled to Rome. He's gone. You lie. Lie to a man seconds from death? What would I gain? He saved himself and left you to die. All this fighting, it's for nothing. For no one. To betray one so trusted. So close. It's a dishonor worth a thousand deaths. Mm -hmm. Eivor, you have shown me a great kindness. It, it is only fitting that I do the same. At Venonis, there is a statue with a scroll laid in a small bowl. You must burn it. A scroll? Your name is on this scroll. At Burgred's request, I put it there. When it is found, the zealots who read it will hunt you. Who are they? It doesn't matter now. You haven't much time. 
Burn the scroll, or they will never stop haunting you. Where will you go now? Rome. Come on, let's take you back. Okay. Careful, you're injured. I'm all right, really. A few nicks and cuts from the battle, that's all. These wounds will heal quickly. You're lucky. I threw myself at him, Abel. But he only toyed with me. He knew I couldn't touch him. You should have stayed hidden. Tailbird, this wasn't your fight. It was. It was our fight. Yours, mine, my father's. I had to help. And you did. You showed courage today. Bravery. You are a boy no longer. Back there with Leofrith. I didn't think you'd spare him. There's no honor in killing a man misled. He believed his king would die fighting for Mercia. He knows the truth now. And with that truth, he forges a new path. Mm -hmm. You were right about him, Chilbert. And right to believe the line that divides us can be thinner than it seems. Stanay, Kogaja. Jailbird! Look at you! Bloody and battle worn! Could be chieftain of your own clan with courage like that. No less than the king of Mercia, brother. One of these days. And how is my father taking to his new role? See for yourself. Mm -hmm. You are an Otlinger now. Or Athling, I think you'd say. Next in line for the throne. It's an honorable title. One that demands good judgment. Be careful who you trust. Mm -hmm. My son. Are you well? Yes, father. Well enough. He honored you today. Fought bravely against many stalwart foes. You have my thanks. All of you. And my blessing. What happens now? Word of Burgred's deposition will spread quickly. The other kingdoms of England will soon enough know that Mercia has a new king. Mm -hmm. The remaining kingdoms of England won't respect your path to power. Nor will many in my kingdom. Burgred's soldiers will stand tall in the face of this turmoil, all across Mercia, against us. That we shall remedy soon enough. I am riding for Oxenifordshire directly, to forge an alliance with some thanes there. Shall I go with you? Not till I know more. Linger here a while if you can. Strengthen our friendships. I will send for you soon enough. Sigurd, I would feel better if Chaelbert was away from here until Mercia is more stable. Would you welcome him among your clan? Hmm. Do you have a horse, young Aveling? I do. A young steed called Theobald. Good. I can ride with you as far as the river Nene. You may find your way from there. Thank you, Sigurd. This puts my mind at ease. Hmm. Be ready for my call, Eivor. It will come. Okay. You and Sigurd make a good pair. The future of England will be pagan from top to bottom. Hmm. Take this, Wolf Kist, as a sign of friendship. But should you call, the brothers Ragnarsson will come. You honor me, Uber. See that? Sly bastard trying to win your heart. Well, two can play at that game. How kind of you you are. <laughs> yes, My pleasure. Our friendship is the best thing to come from this mess. Maybe Chelbert too, the brave little twig. That is good to hear. Now then, Leofrid said there are hunters after me. Zealots. 
If I don't clear my name, I will be marked for death. I should head to Venonis. Tá no metade do caminho. Foda-se. Se dá 2 mil metros é quase 2 km, filho. É muito para andar. E parece que acabamos esta parte do, dos filhos de Ragnar. De Ragnar. Pronto, fica o filho de Ragnar. Se não. <risos> Eu consigo dizer o nome todo. Sai do cavalo. Para lá. Não estamos assim tão longe. Estamos até bastante perto. Ele 
grandissimo anche See you all. Ah, go out, damn you! Yes. Voltas meio demoradas, mas já. Agora vou ver se. 
se aqui buscar aquele ali, mas... off limits. the side. Eu não estava na esfera disto.
Tenho que ir para onde? Para, para o meu tratamento. Começar a incluir a minha arma de bura e já armas e tudo, senão estou tramado. Eu gostaria de ver o que você tem estado Fora, vou começar a... a ler isto. Um bocado. Tem quatro coisas que dá para engolir tudo. Looking powerful. I must be on my way now. Goodbye. Be well, my friend. What are we? Uh, Runa? Item, Randri asked me to see you about finding friends in the cities of England. That's right. London, Jorvik, Winchester, all three are infested by members of the same order to which Kyotve belonged. But their reach extends much further than this. Of all the lands on Earth, I believe England is the most overrun. Do they cause here the same turmoil Kyotve caused in Norway? Not just turmoil. They spread a plague of delusion, teaching men and women to abase and abuse themselves in exchange for power. You have strong feelings about this. Of course. This is the sole purpose of the Hidden Ones, to liberate the body and spirit of man from any unnatural shackles. But we have not operated in England for over four centuries. Since the fall of the Roman Empire, the Hidden Ones have not had a presence here. This absence has given the Order of the Ancients ample room to grow and thrive. Our task will not be an easy one, but with a bureau, Basim and I could begin our work. If you have the time and spare resources to build one, we would be most grateful. I will see what I can do. This will make a fine space for my work, Eivor. Thank you. 
Well, if your work benefits us, I will see that you keep it, for as long as you live among us. I believe it will, for we have common cause against our enemy. They have dug their claws deep into England. Eradicate them where they are strongest, and the alliances you seek will be far easier to come by. Hmm? In London, they now operate without restraint. If you were to eradicate them, the city would be in your debt. I will talk with Ranri about your idea. Get her thoughts. Good. Yet, before you do, there is something else. A gift I wish to share. Okay. A gift? I cannot show you here. Will you walk with me? Okay. I will. Lead on. I hear heaviness to your breathing, Hytham. Does your wound still trouble you? It does, I'm afraid. There is a pain in my chest for which I have no remedy. Rest easy, then. So long as your mind stays sharp, you will recover. Of course. Though I am reluctant to displease my mentor. You would risk your health and your life to please Basim. That I do not understand. I should not expect you do. When we first arrived, I noted a shadow of suspicion in your eyes. A doubt. A wariness. Is that a question? No. Only an observation. Okay. And... And back. Are you well enough to steer this boat? I am. Have no worry. It is only prolonged stresses that exhaust me. The energy runs low rather quickly. What is this gift you wish to give me? It will not come from me. It is a gift you must give yourself. More riddles. What fun you are. Let me say it another way. My gift is not for giving or taking. It is a way of living. Well, still no clearer. It is a thing better demonstrated than described. Then I will wait. Forgive my jest. This gift we call a leap of faith. Oh, it meant. is one of our brotherhood's most sacred rites. It is not a tool we use against our enemies, but an act we embrace to strengthen our resolve. Like your meditation, it centers our minds, steadies our hands, and purges fear from our hearts. And more practically, it aids our movements, in flight or in stealth. You call it a leap, and we are climbing a rather steep hill. <laughs> there it is again, the shadow of a doubt. Nearly there. Our destination is there. I suspect you mean to throw me from this cliff, is that it? Please tell me if I'm near the mark. And spoil the surprise? Do to we... perform the leap of faith, you must give yourself over to something greater. The gods? Yourself. Embrace the hope that death will not come before you are prepared to meet it. Believe this, and you will fear nothing. Our deaths are prefigured, weaved into the fabric of the world. To fear this would be a waste of worry and tears. Good. Then your mind is already attuned to my lesson. Hmm. I should do something for you. No, man, because cada man é aquele cai de caraca, cai mesmo de bunda. I will leap first. On my word, you must follow. Lean into your faith, into your strength, and take flight. You want me to jump? From here? Yes. <laughs> I would sooner grow wings and fly away. Thank you for the lesson, but... Uh... Wait! And watch! Hytham! Hytham! Pig-headed fool! Are you injured? You see? My faith grew stronger than my fear. And that loam cushioned your fall. Eivor, I have not seen this side of you before. Do not feed your fear. Conquer it! 
I've seen my death in a vision. It was not here. Not today. Yeah! A perfect fall. And how did it feel? You spoke true. It was madness and vigor. A purging of fear. A gift I give myself. I see that now. Thank you for showing me the way. Of course. And thank you, Eivor, for hearing me out. You called this leap of faith a sacred rite. Do all Hidden Ones practice this same ritual? As far as I know, it is a rite of initiation that dates back to just before the birth of the Christian Jesus. Are you hoping to initiate me? I might try if I believed you would join, but that is not <laughs> my purpose in England. Basim and I are hunting larger prey. The Order of Ancients. Yes. You remember the medallion you took from Kyotve's body? That is their symbol. They are a plague, one we hope to purge from this world. Like us, they act in secret. But the aim is to rule the world, not free it from unnatural fetters. The desire to rule is not unique to this order. Sigurd and I want the same, a land to call our own, and the honor that comes with it. Do not compare yourself to such people. The order has no honor, no principles, no humanity. Yet they sit on a great many of England's thrones. If you seek to pacify England for the safety of your clan... Then it may be in my interest to give you aid. I understand. You desire alliances. We seek to rid England of its deepening rot. Where these hopes meet, our cause does too. You may think this land ruled by harmless jarls and bumbling thames. Yet look more closely and you will find a deeper threat. The Order's invisible hand touches all. It shapes everything, instilling its poison into every level of society. From the lowliest fishmonger to the richest merchants, from wealthy thanes to useless kings, the Order has corrupted all. Okay. Bassam has given me one task here. To locate and eliminate the Order of Ancients in England, in whatever dark corners they reside. If we work together towards this end, it will benefit us both. You will have greater influence over the kingdoms of England. And you will have more medallions to count. Exactly. You should begin in London. I have credible reports that the Order is working now to seize the city. I will speak with Ranbury about this. And while you are there, be on the lookout for our symbol. Centuries ago, the Hidden Ones had bureaus built around England. There were six, I believe. If you can find them, Search them well for documents bearing the same symbol. It will greatly aid my studies. I will. Thank you, Hatham. For all of this. É bem. Já conseguimos. Desvotas. Grande Magister. Não. Podia dar a bola assim. Mais dois três. Então. Com o Randy, claro. Ah, glad to see you made it, Chelbat. Thanks to Sigurd. He was a good guide and even better company. He told me some incredible stories. The best ones were about you. Hopefully nothing too embarrassing. There were a few gems. Not to interrupt, Davor, but what of Little Chestershire? The Alliance is one. The sons of Ragnar are friends to our clan. Glad to hear it. Well done to you both. Chestershire. Eivor. A word of note. Someone has set up shop outside. A trader, I believe. When you can, ask him his business here. He seems to represent a larger guild. 
The child's eyes? Or the eyeless children? Eyeless children? No, huh? that cannot be right. Ask him yourself. Okay. Word of our growing settlement has reached outside ears. So have a look around. You may see a few new faces. I want to see the Alliance map. Agora vamos fazer o quê? Temos Cambridge e temos aqui. Só que o poder de, daqui é 90. Eu só tenho 32, por isso. Tell me about Brandebridge, Shire. Oi? A force of Danes, called the Summer Army by the Saxons, is <laughs> north of Brandebridge, at some ruins across the river. We should curry favor with their leaders, Guthrum and Soma, if we hope to win their trust and allegiance. My scouts did not meet them in person, so I can say little for the state of their army. Consider this a starting point. Ubisoft, corrija isso aí que está tudo, aquela mulher está bugada. I will leave right away. Good. And may the blessings of Freya follow. A caça da cova está toda bugada. long in England, have you? I see by this map you've barely scratched mercy. customer whether I am or not I am the one you'll speak with Randry tells me you are merchants ah oh, hello hello are you the leader of this bustling encampment <laughs> we come on behalf of a thousand eyes vendors of uncommon goods and exotic treasures from all corners of the world if you need it we have it if we don't have it, you don't need it. Such is our pledge. I see. And is this child with you? Child? Child. My friend, you look upon the master of the thousand eyes, the head of our guild, a Tell legend, you. a hero of the people, and the richest merchant west of the Indus. You look upon Redda. That means you? He does, Eivor Wolfkist. It is a pleasure to meet you at last. Okay. How have you come to know me? The Thousand Eyes have one thousand years as well, and word travels fast. Okay. And what is it I can do for you, or you for me? It's quite simple. For a fee, I can connect you to a shadow market that stretches from the dunes of Egypt to the moors of England. What sort of fee? It varies with the item, but there is a small hitch. Through this market, all prices are paid in opal. opal. Interesting. What a strange color it has. May I hold it? You may hold it and keep it, Eivor. A gift from Reda for an immeasurable hospitality. Now look here. Browse what wares I have on offer. Okay. Isto é 150, não? 120. Isto é um escudo de seco. Puta. Nothing for now? No matter. My selection changes daily. You will soon find something you like. Now that you are friends with me, you are also a friend of the Thousand Eyes as well. And what does this mean? Observe my outfit, not the scarf I wear. As you travel, you will meet many of my associates clad in these same vestments. These are my people. My other eyes. Seek them out for trade or contracts. Oblige them, and you will earn a tidy sum. And I might even feel inclined to reward you myself. Okay. An interesting offer. Good to hear. Now, if you will excuse us, my apprentice has a tent to secure. You're staying for a while, I suppose. Oh, yes, and you needn't even thank me. We would be honored to call this our home. Good day. Mm. 
Hello, Avor. <clears throat> good day. That would be good. Can you remind me what you do here? If you want to deal with your raiders, you come through me. I'll make sure they're ready for you and keep them in fighting shape. You need to build some barracks. Otherwise, these raiders are going to get soft. And we can't have that. Okay. I will see you later, friend. Be well. Oh, thank you. No. 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 Impossível. Missões. Hum. Ok. To the Swan Road. I can't raise the sail here. I know. Sing us a song. Randvi mentioned this place, the last known location of the Summer Army.
Can you no way to die. That's true Christian behavior. To slaughter us in our sleep. Nothing Hail! What has happened here? Who is asking? Eivor, of the Raven Clan. I have heard the name. You helped the sons of Ragnar overthrow the Mercian king. Mm -hmm. Well met. Did you and your men fail to take the village? No. No, we had it for a time. It was nothing but a cluster of wattle and daub huts when we came. We made it lively. Grantbridge was a thriving hub of trade and song under the care of Suma Ayalskona. But the Saxons took it back. They appeared within the city as if rising from the shadows and drove us out. They just appeared in the city. It was like they burst out of the center of the city itself, setting aflame everything in their path, shouting some nonsense about an ancient order of warriors. By the time I saw the fires, too many of us were killed or captured. Okay. Our Yasko Masuma, she bellowed the retreat and we took refuge in the ruins. But in the chaos, we were separated. She and the bulk of our forces fled northeast into the swamps. I'd follow if we were fit to. We need her iron fist. I can find Soma. Be ready when we return. Yeah. She'll be deep in the fog of the Fenlands by now. Find her longship. That's your best bet. Draca? Draca sound Soma. Our Cambridge Museum. Sail here. Strike up a tune. Can't raise the sail yet. And the sail. More sail. We can continue later. Looks like Ragnarok itself. For Grand Bridge. A great battle raged nearby. Old course. We'll see what else lies within the fork. Camp. Stretch your wings, Sunan.
cabeças. O YouTube vai durar isto. Sure, Yard's corner nearby. Not here. Shoma dragged the Saxons east from her longship to tire them out and lose them in the fog. Chasing more in a month, my friend. You come like a Valkyrie out of the fog. We have no dead to give you. You must be Soma. Let's talk elsewhere. Give them a chance to rest. Quite a hit you took. How many were lost? It's kind of you to ask, but with so much blood in the water and death on the air, I'd know your name and purpose first. Eivor of the Raven Clan. I came for you, looking for a friend and ally. I see. I'm Soma, Lord of Granbridge. Though it seems an Order of Lunatics wishes to strip me of that title. The Order of the Ancients? Sounds right. The Saxon called Wigmund is one of them. He robbed me of my city, forced us into these swamps. I've rallied some of my soldiers, but my three advisors are missing. If we hope to retake Grantbridge, I'll need them at my side. Tell me about them. They are my best, my inner circle. Birna, Galin, Liv. We may as well be of the same blood. If I can reunite them and we retake your city, can I call you a friend and ally? If you can do all that, you can call me whatever you want. Where's this Wigmund? What does he want? He's a flailing elderman under the old king. A bitter man digging his fingernails into Grand Bridge, just to say he can. He's made many attempts to unseat me before. This time he managed a trick. What happened to Grandbridge? Yeah. The elder man Wigman seized it from us. I'm not sure how he managed, but he will not keep it. Not for long. He has supporters outside the city. But this attack seemed to come from inside the walls. From the heart of Grandbridge. Let's find your advisors. Agreed. We'll look for signs of their longboats along the river. And if we are swift, we will find them before the wolves do. The fog is more hindrance than hiding place now. Let's light the way back. Spiegel. Ich 
sem dar isto. Mais dois pontos ali dá. Burn long and hut, bright wolf of the branch, and guide Soma's gilded warriors home. I know what you must think. What must I think? That it's foolish to search the Fenlands for so few people. You told me the soldiers you lost were your best. Vital to retake in the city. Do you think it's foolish? Not at all. Then why would I? You have the look of one who does well with solitude. You're alone, a wanderer. It may be you think of soldiers as war. You have the look of one who does well with solitude. You're alone, a wanderer. It may be you think of soldiers as war fodder and little else, but these warriors are more than a blade and shield. They are my family, nothing short. I've lost a city this week. I will not lose them too. I understand. And if your people yet live, We'll find them. Hey. Galen, you look terrible. What happened here? Saxons chased me into a fog, ran me smack into a nest of bandits. I'm afraid I was on my side. And I saw them before they saw me. Are you the only one of your crew left standing? I am.
be standing myself. But with the blessings of Odin and Freya, they'll be feasting well with the gods. I've set a camp not far from here, marked by a beacon. Go there, Galen, and recover. Eivor and I will find you. He's a serious man, Galen. Mm -hmm. Yes, and a man of the gods. He carries them around in his mind as a tree bears its branches. It makes his mind heavy, but it keeps our spirits light, knowing the gods give us... Let me continue. It makes his mind heavy, but it keeps our spirits light, knowing the gods give us favor. Saxons surrounding that old hut. There may be Danes trapped inside. That's right! Tire yourself out! Weak little kittens. Can't even open one barricaded door! You rot in hell when we're done with you. You'll suck my toes when I'm standing on your head. That's beer enough, for sure. If my head was in a bucket of water, oh, I'd still know. Why the force? outside we handle it just fine thinking of starting a new town in fact this house being our first i pitched a camp nearby under a burning beacon we'll meet you there when i found the others thank you soma and you as well sambi we'll head to the camp now. i'll have everyone singing songs and dancing by the time we get back <laughs> Birna and Galen. Like ice and fire, I'd imagine. This longboat is Birna's, I think. All scraped and bashed, it's hard to tell. A group of Danes held captive.
If you would be so kind, I've had quite the day. Follow on, leave. Birna and Galen are safe at the camp we've made. Eivor, you meet us there when you're ready. Huh? Travou! Até ao acampamento de Soma e vamos acabar o episódio por aqui. Olha comigo, não. Não estou lá lá ainda. Estava a chegar a uma hora e tal. Este episódio vai ser ligeiramente mais pequenino, vai ser do tamanho dos outros. The beacon has drawn the last of my soldiers. By tomorrow our strength will have returned and we can retake our city. I have not yet spoken to Leif, Birna and Galen about this. After my missteps, I worry what they must think of me. They'll be grateful you risk your life to find them. I would be. By Thor's hammer, I am glad we're together. In spite of our setback. Galen, you look... well worn. Do not grieve the men you lost. They will be singing your praises in the corpse hall, waiting for us. Thank you, Yars Corner. Leif, you'd outlast any tempest. It's good to be back, Soma, all as one. And know this, that I will follow you through the eye of the storm if you called. Birna. I'm delighted you're alive. I'm delighted to be living. Mm -hmm. I lost so many after all this. But I still have you three. That makes me the most blessed warrior in Midgard. And Eivor, you have more than proven your worth. Help us reclaim our city, and you will have an ally in me. My blade is yours, for Grandbridge. Yeah. We'll rest for the night, gather our strength and our wits, and at the break of dawn's light, we retake Grandbridge. Pass the night in our camp, Eivor. Take anything you need. Like more of Soma's forces followed the beacon back to camp.